This town hall comes as we're learning more about a teenager involved in a deadly shooting this week. Police say that teenager got the gun from his brother. What we learned uh, prior to this incident. According to Police Chief James Davis, an altercation that led a 16-year-old to allegedly shoot and kill a man outside a dollar store on Capitol Street Monday started across the street at a gas station. So while at that uh, gas station, uh, the 16-year-old retrieved a gun from his brother's car and chased this individual down and shot him. Investigators say 21-year-old William Tellis died from multiple gunshot wounds. They say days earlier, he chased the teen with a broken beer bottle. Uh, it's a sad situation uh, when you got a 16-year-old taken upon himself to uh, resolve the issue with a handgun. That killing marks the city's 126th murder of 2021, four shy of the record 130 homicides Jackson saw in 2020. JPD has also investigated more than 80 carjackings in this latest deadly shooting. The chief says the 16-year-old's brother won't face any criminal charges. Uh, he did not give him the gun. Uh, the gun was in his car, and he had the right to have a gun in his car. Chief Davis believes the city needs to build a municipal jail to hold suspects. He says since the pandemic began, the city has been forced to release more than 3,000, field release more than 3,000 misdemeanor suspects. That's because at the county jail, they're not allowed to hold anyone other than felony offenders because the county is under a federal consent decree. Live in West Jackson, Ross Adams, 16 WAPT News.